What's up, guys? How you all doing? So, uh, I have literally just got back from Blue Water. We went over there to uh, just grab a meal. Uh, had a good couple of days over the last couple of days, business-wise. So, I went out to celebrate uh, with Jade and have literally just got back. So, I thought I'd bring you guys a vlog because a couple of people have already messaged me and said, Adam, no vlog today because I've been doing it kind of daily. So, uh, here you go. Here is today's vlog. I hope you guys uh, enjoy me talking shit. But anyway... The bit of news that I've really got to update you guys on today is that uh, I am, or I have, sorry, I'm stuttering here because I'm staring at the tiny dot lens um, that people want me to stare at and it just, it trips you out, I've got to tell you. So yeah, um, bit of news for today, I have ordered a 4K TV. Now a lot of you guys have probably heard my plans before, but my plan is to get a Canon 1DC, which is a, basically a 1DX with 4K ability in terms of video. Uh, this is not a plan, this is going to happen in fact. Uh, and I would have liked to have had uh, a 4K monitor to edit on and to view it on. Now there's not really any 4K content at the moment, so it's not going to be like a TV that I'm going to sit and watch content on. This is really just for kind of trial, uh, for when I start doing my 4K videos to be able to edit on and see it in its kind of true form if you like. So I've uh, the one that, um, this guy that I follow, Philip Bloom, a lot of you probably would have heard of him, very good uh, video guy, he bought one. Uh, it's some Chinese company called Psyche, I think, S-E-I-K-I, -E -I, I believe it's called. And I bought it from Amazon.com, and it comes in at about £450, a 39-inch 4K TV for £450, plus, say, £100 import and shipping, etc. So for £550, I've got a 39-inch 4K TV, which I will probably put here. So if the TVs are kind of here, uh, the, sorry, the monitors are here. I'll probably just put it up on this wall here. So it should be kind of cool. Really looking forward to getting it. It's got very, very good reviews. Um, and uh, Philip Bloom himself says it's actually a very good uh, kind of little 4K TV. So I'm pretty excited about getting that. I've not obviously owned a 4K TV before. Definitely not ready to splash out five grand on a kind of really expensive Sony or you know Samsung 4K jobby. So this should be a kind of interesting little emergence into the 4K market and it's going to be really cool to be able to take videos on the 1DC in 4K and then watch it back uh, in 4K as well. So anyway guys, uh, let me know your thoughts on 4K. Is 4K the new 3D if you like? Is it going to take over uh, in the next couple of years? Is it the way forward? Uh, is 3D dead? You know, let me know what your thoughts are uh, in the comments. And uh, that's it for me today, guys. Uh, peace, have a great evening, and I'll see you in the next one.